Hi, welcome to Vodzilla Vision. We're talking vanity with vanities. <laughs> Today we're talking falls and wigs. Now for rats, rats are used to create volume and shape in the hair. You can use things like the bump it, which I personally don't think work that great. Or there's other uh, um, spongy options that you can get at the beauty supply store, or you can make your own. You can make your own by using hair from your own brush or old wigs that you don't want, kind of wrap them up together and wrap them in a hairnet to create a shape that's going to fit on the head but create volume. I personally like to use two rats together for that extra added volume. Now, when I use a rat, I'm going to section off the front of the hair. It really depends on where you want to use the rat. I'm going to use it on the back of her head to create that extra 60s style bouffant. So again, just like with the curlers, creating that area. And we're gonna place the rat right on the back of her head. And pin it in. Now we're going to use our teasing brush to take the front section of her hair give it just a little tease to cover the rat And you can take from the side as well and do the same thing. Cover the rat and then do a little bit of pinning. And you create this glorious 60s bouffant bump. Voila. Now the other way to use rats is you can use them in combination with falls. Now for the stage, I love a fall. It's a 10 minute hairstyle that gives you length and curls and drama and glamour. So the way that you can use a fall, section off the front, just like before with a natural hair in the bump. Except with this, I like to use, um, I like to clip the back up a little bit. And that's just going to give a base for the fall to catch on to. And also, it keeps the hair separate so you kind of know what's real and what's fake. And it doesn't have to be perfect or gorgeous when you're pinning up back here. It just has to, just has to give you a nice base. I like to do it in threes. So as you can see, it's just up, it's messy, it's sloppy, but it's no big deal. Now I'm gonna take the fall, it has a comb at the top and a comb at the bottom. So we're gonna push the top comb right under the rat, securing it. Then we're gonna take the bottom and clip it right under her natural hair where we pinned. Now to hide the seam, as you can see, there's a little bit of a seam from here to here. Just make sure you tuck all that hair under. Then we're gonna rat, uh, tease the top a little bit and then smooth it over. T 
teeth aside. Let's move that over too. I take it all and give it a little pin. And one more pin to secure it. I like to crisscross the pins. It really locks the hair into place, locks your locks. And one smooth with the teasing comb. Fix the bangs a little bit. And this is the vanities.